And welcome back to more Pix Plays, Man of Medan, second playthrough. Had some issues at the beginning of trying to record episode 8, there was a glitch. It's been updated, so let's jump back in now. That's it, get it all out. Uh, yeah. You uh, want to go lie down? Yeah. You know, maybe I should. Oh boy. Let's see those hot picks. What about over here? It's pretty far out of the way. I'm just thinking about backup targets in case we don't find anything on the dive team. Listen, to be honest, I've never heard of this wreck you're looking for. Usually these things are crawling with ice. Well, hot yeah. diggity dong. Look at this. <laughs> Alex! Come here! I think we got something. Travis is so sure we're gonna be here. Yeah, I mean, what are the odds we're really gonna find a needle in a haystack? I'm gonna go help Conrad and Julia with the camera. What you got? There we go. That's where it was glitched at. So we're good. Feast your eyes on this. Brad's calculations were right on the money. Always bet on Brad. Yeah, that kid's a whiz. We should thank him. Fliss, we found a plane. Yeah? Yeah, it looks like World War II. We are ready to dive. Uh, technically, we should call this in to port authorities as an unreported wreck. Well, technically. Are you sure you don't want to do this the right way? Wait, are you saying we shouldn't dive? Mm, let's do this this time. Guys, look, I think we got to listen to our experienced, beautiful, smart, and beautiful captain here. If she says we should do Carney, things the right- please, I didn't bring you on this trip to get laid. Wait, what? <laughs> No, 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 it's not, I, I, I'm just saying she's right, not because she's beautiful. I mean, she is beautiful, but that's like a coincidence. She's the captain. Look, we paid for this dive, generously, we're diving. You're the client. But if anything goes wrong, I just can't wait to be the first one down there. Can you imagine, I'm touched? We should be ready to get you guys in the water in a few. I'll set up the tanks. The boys will do the final checks. Take a look at the camera. See if you can find anything useful. Righto. Hey, maybe you should check on your bro. Mm -hmm. Maybe you should check on your bro. I'm gonna go talk. Hey, to you. hey, back. Can't talk to you. What? You patched it up with Brad yet? Not so simple. What am I looking for? I don't know what I was looking for. Hey, sis. Mm-hmm. Hey, Connie, how's it going? Uh. Uh. Mm. Uh. Okay. Hey, uh, mind if I help you out a little? One, why are you acting so weird? And two, why are you offering to help for, like, the first time ever in your life? Look, I was just thinking it might make a good first impression on the lovely Fliss. Okay, now three, don't call her the, she's a person, not a thing. And four, do you ever even think about anything else? Hey, lady's got a thirst, and I'm here to quench it. And what's with all the numbers? Oh, yeah, I forgot. Bro's afraid of math, and that's five. Gotta say, not too happy with our captain at the moment. Uh, no, I'm just hey, she's all right. She's just a bit of a stickler for the rules. The word is bitch. Hey, look, she's not gonna be down there with you. She can't stop you from doing shit. Connie, you gotta keep it in your pants around Fliss. 
Just cool it with all your desperate pickup bullshit. Uh, desperate? Look, I could charm the fish from the sea, sister. Just you wait. All right, I'm gonna get these rebreathers set up and then we'll go through the final steps together. Great. I'm gonna kick back and uh, enjoy the sights for a little while. And by enjoy the sights, I mean I'm gonna ogle our captain like a grade A creep. Yeah, I got it. Gross. Hey, at least I'm honest. Still gross. Well, at least he's honest. All right, let's check this again. I don't really think I'm gonna find anything different. Hmm. I hope there might be a way in. Give me the option if you won't let me go as fast as I want to. Hurry up and give me the option for weasel. Shizzle. You know the dizzle. Water rock. Got to stop. That's left. Put it down. Put it down. Back out. All right, let's go. Hit on plus again. Oh, captain, my captain. You know, we have rules out here for a reason. You guys got to respect that. At least you showed me a little respect. Even if you're the only one in the group. Uh, Jolie can be intense. Ah, oh, yeah. Sorry about that. My sis can be a little... Uh... Intense? Uh, that's one way to put it. There are laws here. And customs. You gotta respect that. These rules are all pretty basic stuff. How much experience do you have with these kind of dives? <laughs> I don't want to be assertive. Oh, I got experience. In all the right places, if you catch yeah, one. Yeah, I caught it. And I tossed it back. Oh, damn. You don't seem to give up easily, do you? For all you know, this could be a war grave. Disturbing it would be illegal and immoral. Um, I don't want to be assertive. Let's, yeah. You know, you're even more intoxicating when you're angry. And I am ready to get wasted. You have literally never spoken to a woman before in your life, have you? No. Hmm. <laughs> Chops. I don't think she was uh, enamored with my charm, my guys. Mm, so this is her ID. I think this might be bogus. I think I've seen that with Alex last time. Let's go check on Bradster. Not gonna touch that this time. No, 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 go back down. I love these games. The controls sometimes can be a pain in the rear end, though. Let's see if it's different Hello. this time. So this time I'm not going to say anything about Brad, I'm just going to let him just be down here. Uh, go over here, there's nothing over here to get, okay. Go over here. That's her room. What's in here? Hello, locker. What you got inside of you? Interesting. What's this now? Fancy. Get on you, Alex. Huh. I don't remember Alex putting it there. I remember him putting it somewhere else. Here, mm, 
nothing else in here. Can I go in here? No. So let's go in here. How you feeling? Shouldn't have had that beer. No sweat, Braddy Shack. We'd be hanging up top, should you care to join? <laughs> yeah, I'll be up as soon as I... <clears throat> Stop puke-heaving. Wow, I can't unhear that term. All right. All right. Please do not fondle machinery you are not equipped to understand. You might want to just let it do its thing. Well, I can't turn it back on. So, that's that. Okay, so this is the rebreather. Way cooler than a regular scuba setup. It takes all that CO2 that you'd normally just exhale into the water, and instead, it gets totally reused. Then it reduces decompression time on your way out. State of the art. Okay, O2 check done. Whoa, 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 eager beaver, you gotta check your O2 first. Looking good, Jay. I'd like to take you underwater. Hey, that's my sis you're talking about. You know it. Oh, hey, guys. What, Jesus, why are you so loud? I almost completely forgot. When I was looking at the dive cam, I saw this huge hole in the tail. Kablooey. That's your way into the plane. Oh, nice work, man. Thanks, Conrad. Okay, you little clown fishes. I'm gonna go see what Fliss is up to. You behave, Connie. How's it going? Are those two going in or what? Mm -hmm. Like I know the weight is interminable, but soon, soon it'll just be you and me. Out of the frying pan. All right, kids, good to go. Just remember the rules, please. I've been paying her no attention. Disrespectful. Alright, so it'll be interesting to see if they let us stay up top this time. Souvenir would be cool. It's not like one tiny little thing would hurt anybody. I won't tell if you won't. <laughs> it's not like we can scan the wreck every night at sundown. There. That shape. That's gotta be it. Whoa. That is, like, way bigger than I thought. Damn. I mean, it's a plane. It's pretty intact, too. This is a fucking remarkable find. Let's swim around a little and find a way in. Conrad said one of the pictures showed an opening. But try, mm -hmm. we can get in through there. Could be really dangerous. Uh, ladies first. <laughs> Can 
can I just take a second to say, holy shit, Alex, we did it. I mean, can you believe it? What was in here again? Leave it. You'd have to take your gear off to get in there. Not worth it. That pipe's pretty tight. What if you get stuck without your rebreather? He has a point. Maybe it is kind of dangerous. See, I don't understand why I'm playing as Julia again. I played as her in this part last time. down the fuselage. Brad's gonna flip when he sees this. Check it out. They reconfigured the bomb rack to hold lifeboats. Interesting. One of the rescue boats is missing. Think they were using it? Let's see what else we can find. Mm -hmm. Why are we playing as her again? What's different this time? Good God. <sighs> Ugh. Ugh. He's holding something. happen here and we'll look at things they knew they were goners let's keep moving uh you hear that let's check it out want to go first I'm not going front, I jumped a little. Pilot and co-pilot. Gotta be. Plane crash not high on my list of ways to perish. And I think I have to touch something. I don't think I can't not. Easy now. This stuff's been down here a long time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know what she was trying to accomplish, but I had to do it. I had to. I don't think I could not. Maybe I could have. And I don't have to go back out. Before last time, I went over there to do that, and I did that, and then it was like, all right, you're good. You can leave now. But this time, I missed something, apparently. 
What did me miss? What did me miss? Uh, Rit. That was weird. Howdy, Captain. You fancy a pint with your second in command? You are not my second in command. Third in command. No. Fresh in your cabin, boy. <laughs> Still a no. Your well paying, dashingly handsome, seafaring client is requesting the pleasure of your company over a frosty amber liquid. Do, 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 do. Sure. Why not? This part seems to be Pretty exactly nice the way I played it last Where'd time. Mm -hmm. It's a long story. It's complicated and it's really difficult to explain. Well, I'm a complicated guy. Try me. Well, it involves at least several trips to the bank and signing of big stacks of paper with large numbers on them. So you took out a loan. You know, you're smarter than you look. If you're interested, maybe my family can make an investment in your business. <laughs> That's very kind of you to offer. I suppose we could have that conversation. Uh, you know what? I better spend some time keeping the Duke of Milan ship shape. Aye, aye. Maybe I didn't play as hard last time. Wow. That is not your everyday wreck. I hope those clowns don't get me in trouble. Call them clowns, like they're bozos. All right, put that back down. No, back out. That's not what I wanted to grab. I wanted to grab that. Duke to Alex. Duke to Julia. No, I did play with her because I kind of remember that. Let's see here. Nothing to see at the moment. Let's see here. I'll talk to you last. Talk to them. Duke of Milan. 20 miles north of the coast, over. Reading you, how can we help, over? Looking for a weather report in my area, over. Got a severe front heading into your vicinity from northwest. Thunder, lightning, 21 knot winds. Keep an eye on that. We'll check you in the AM rounds, over. Appreciate the heads up, but we got this under control, over. Let's look at this. Mm, go downstairs. Now, is it wonder if it would be cool if it was different every time you looked at it with somebody? 
but apparently that's not the case. Let's go in her room. What's in her room? Why do I keep these around? So basically, don't go off with Conrad or he might get shot at. Let's see what she says about this. Nothing. That was a little pointless. Check on Brad, my man. How's it going? Knocked out by cold frosty. Man, I feel like such a wimp. Hey, it's your vacation. You're allowed to overdo it. I am officially starting a temperance club. Party of one. Lifetime membership. Hope the lovebirds are having the time of their lives down there. What do you know about this wreck? Just rumors and theories. I got tired of the speculation and wanted to see if there was actually anything there. Huh? Hey, Fliss. Look, there's a boat. What's that about? That is not the Coast Guard. So we're not under arrest. How should we handle this? Feels off. This feels off. Just be quiet and don't say anything stupid, okay? Am I gonna do the up top part this time? Guys, you gotta keep back. We've got divers in the water. Damage here, you see this? Look at our boat. We can take care of this, man. It's not a problem. What do you think? Like, uh, 10 bucks cover it? Oh, whoops, my bad. Let's make it 20. Well, shoot, you, you think it's more like 30? I can do 30. All right, you guys drive a hard bargain, but I'm with you. Here, let's just throw in the whole pot. Why? No! Like, why do that? I guess they didn't need the money. <laughs> the only thing funnier than watching you try to buy your way out of that situation is seeing your money go to waste. I got a smile out of you. Worth every penny. You're a piece of work, Conrad. I'm not all work, I'm a little play, too. Are you trying to flirt with me? Is it working? I don't even know what it is. Well, when you think of something, I'll just be over here taking in the view, flirting up a storm, hashtag wink. Okay, I think they're on their way back up. And I was getting used to it just being you and me. We need to light the grill. Oh, oh, pick me, pick me. You can call me Grill Capitan. You may light the grill, but I will never call you that. Oh, fuck! Son of a bitch. Ah, uh, damn, Fliss. I I'm sorry. <sighs> Hmm. 
Damn it! This is my fault. My boat, my fault. Hey, what the hell is going on? Uh, hey, JJ, don't worry about it. There was a little, uh, mishap with the barbecue. Jesus, looked like the whole boat was lit up. What was up with that other boat? These fishing guys came by and ran into the dive line. Whatever. Who cares, right? What I want to know is, what'd you guys find? Well, we found the plane, and it is huge, full of cool stuff. Oh my god, you guys, can you all just shut up for like one second? <laughs> Holy shit! Dude, bro, congrats. Nicely done. Come up and let's celebrate. And that is where we're going to have to leave this episode. Oh, well, after the recap, I guess. <laughs> You're getting to know these intrepid adventurers then. Alex yep. and his little brother Brad trying to swim with the big fish both seem out of their depth and Julia the love of Alex's life and he the love of hers what about Conrad a bold fellow you might say or maybe you'd say arrogant and then there's Captain Fliss strong forthright stubborn she appears somewhat immune to Conrad's charms, so far at least. Let me reassure you, you help them to make some decisions they'll value later on. And some I think they may regret. Nah, not me. I put them all on the right path. Don't you lie to me like that. We are going to end this episode here, so thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed, please like, comment, subscribe, share. All that helps to grow the channel. Growing the channel helps me to be able to do more videos, do more things. And, uh, yeah, that would be appreciated. So if you want to watch live weeknights around 10 p.m., Mixer.com slash Morpix. Or you can watch it on demand there also later. Um, if you want to wait till the next day, weekdays, 2 and 3 p.m., uploads on YouTube, YouTube.com slash Morpix. Or you can check morepix.com for all the Let's Plays, the game trailer of the day, and the movie trailer of the day. But until next time, peace out. Be happy, be safe. See you next time.